SmartAir is quick to set up and easy to use. Firstly, determine the extent of the repair area and tape out this section. Then cover the area with SmartAir's unique pre-perforated masking, Smart Mask. The masking is transparent and it's static controlled, which means the masking stays in place without the need for magnets, even on vertical panels. Cut out the area to be primed or painted using the blade provided. Take care to cut the masking neatly around the repaired area. Remove the cutouts and mask down the loose ends to the vehicle to ensure that no overspray can escape during painting. The next step is to position the Smart Air hood centrally over the repair area, placing the back edge of the hood with the rubber protection strip as close to the panel as possible. The system is highly manoeuvrable and designed to reach all vertical areas on a vehicle. Using this vertical adjustment handle, you can slide the hood up and down the mast, enabling you to place the hood exactly where you need it. Smart Air is adjustable horizontally too, enabling you to prime or smart repair wing tops, bonnets and tailgates. Ensure that you firmly tighten both the vertical and horizontal adjustment handles. You then need to attach the Smart Air mask to the Smart Air hood. Simply pull the Smart mask through the rubber retaining band, working your way around the entire hood. Take care not to detach the mask from the vehicle. The end result is a sealed area that will contain all paint mists and vapours. Give the masked area a quick final visual check to make sure you're happy with the seal. With the hood firmly secured in place, connect the flexible hose between the hood and the extract tower using the quick release connections. Switch the unit on, fit your personal protective mask, attach your spray gun to the airline provided and you're ready to paint. Once Smart Air is switched on, air is pulled into the containment area, providing a positive flow of air that will prevent the escape of any overspray, as this smoke test demonstrates. As the atomized paint contacts the vehicle surface, it travels along the panel, striking the masking and then the aerofoil hood. Once it hits the hood, it is channeled around the profile, exiting the hood through the particulates filter. Yeah.